so it's part of my healthy eating i have to wash my veggies i've already washed the um broccoli and yes i literally wash them make sure you rinse them off really really well um yeah so i just set them in um soak them in water with a teeny tiny bit of soap just a teeny tiny bit and just really you know get them cleaned So I did the broccoli, I'm working on the green beans, and then next I'll do the spinach. While the green beans are, while the green beans are in the water, Angela and AJ are outside playing. Mm -hmm. um, anyway, so while the green beans are in the wash, I'm gonna go ahead and chop up the um, broccoli and put it in the bag. Well, Got one chopped, on to the next one. And the second one is chopped. So now I'm gonna add this to the bag. Now I'm going to rinse the green beans and chop them on the cutting board and then put them in a bag also. All right, broccoli and green beans are all chopped. So I'm going to zip them up and they're going to go in the freezer depending on what I'm going to cook this week. So if I'm going to cook them this week, I'm going to put them in the um, fridge. So now I'm going to wash the um, spinach. So I picked some fresh water. I've already um, uh, grinded up the um, green bean ends. So all that is gone and I got a fresh thing of water so i'm gonna wash the spinach and then um do the celery and carrot so i'm gonna use cold water to rinse i'm just gonna take a handful and just rinse them off real good Give a good shake and place it in the bag. The thing with spinach, of course, you know, you need a lot of spinach because when you cook it, it's gonna basically shrink. So you may have like this whole handful of spinach, like, oh yeah, I'm good with all this, and then you cook it and it's like a spoonful. <laughs> so, ooh, good rinse and in the bag. Alright, so I got everything sort of chopped up and bagged up and ready to go. Um, I put some carrots aside for AJ. I'm going to have to cook these and then chop them, make them a little bit softer. I hate carrots. So I didn't really realize that carrots are like really like hard and crunchy. Like they were hard. So I'm like, I'm going to cook them and soften them up and then chop them up. And then put them in the Ziploc bag so that way he can have this like, you know, part of his dinner or part of his lunch. Um, I chopped up celery sticks. So I got celery sticks for me and Angelo. And then I got some smaller sticks for AJ. AJ loves to dip. Like he loves uh, french fries and ketchup and um, really anything that he can dip. He likes chips and salsa, chips and ranch dip whatever he likes dip so i figured celery and ranch dip he'll love it so then i got my spinach here and my green beans and my broccoli and then the rest of the carrots are there and i'm gonna put those in the um in the fridge and get all of these packed up now this is what a fridge should look like minus the kool-aid <laughs> Healthy eating. Dinner for today is spinach and sweet potatoes. And of course I have the regular potatoes in here too, but just the sweet potatoes. So let's cook. So the spinach is on. And I just put um, a little bit of, well I put water at the bottom, like just enough water to cover the bottom. And then I put salt and pepper, and then I put in the um, spinach leaves. And I only used half of what I had in the bag. 
because pretty much it's gonna be me and AJ eating the spinach. Um, so I didn't want to have like too much. So I got enough for another day of dinner. So um, I put the spinach leaves in, and then I put uh, more salt and pepper on top. So I'll let that cook down, and then um, taste it, and then add more um, salt if needed. And then potatoes. I took the sweet potatoes and I um, punctured holes all in the um, all around the potatoes, and then I wrapped them up in paper towels and wet them. And I got a uh, two layer. Um, wet paper towel will land on top and I'm gonna pop this in the microwave and Cook my sweet potatoes that way so Eat 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 and AJ is over there eating lunch slash snack slash pre dinner yeah all his stuff just thrown all over my pretty kitchen table but yeah, that's what you get when you have toddlers. Nothing stays clean or neat. So we're gonna put the sweet potatoes in the microwave. And I am going to set it on potato. And it's asking how many, and I got four in there. So I'm gonna say five, because I like it to be like really done. And it's not letting me do five. So the, um, Sweet potatoes are going. It only let me do four potatoes, so it started off at um, 15 minutes, 30 seconds. So I may have to add some more minutes to it because I, I really want my sweet potatoes to be like soft. I don't want them hard. And the spinach is cooking down. I'm gonna get um, something to stir it with. Serving fork. And yep. All withered away. Yeah, so I end up just throwing the whole bag in there. <laughs> and you can see what it's withered down to. I think that's plenty for me and AJ. Especially for us to have like leftovers for tomorrow, so that will work. And the potatoes are done and the microwave is all steamed up. But I'm going to add like another five minutes because I just want to make sure they're soft. Yeah. Alright, so I took the sweet potatoes out. I'm going to um, uh, basically like cut it open like a baked potato and then scrape the inside out in here. Add a little bit of sugar and basically just have like mashed sweet potatoes. Oh my gosh, y'all, that would be so good. So um, I'll probably put like a little milk in it and um, some sugar and stir it all up. Yeah, so this is how they look coming out of the microwave. Oh, they're really soft too. Oh, I love that. All right, so I'm going to, like I said, cut them open like a baked potato and just scrape the um, inside out in here, add some milk and a little bit of sugar and stir it up. And we'll have that and spinach. And I'm being ran over by my child. He's running over my feet. Oh, and then the other one is over there crying. All right, so mommy needs to hurry up, doesn't she? Right, AJ? Mommy needs to hurry up? Okay. Amari says I do. All right, so. <laughs> that's Why is this toys in here? Right, so my sweet potatoes are all gutted. And this is what the dish looks like. So, I'm going to add some sugar, a little bit of milk, and stir it all up. So, I have like a creamy dish of mashed sweet potatoes with my spinach. I got my spinach sitting on low. So, yeah. Ooh, yeah. And I'm just using regular sugar. Regular sugar. Regular. Regular sugar and um, so delicious um, organic almond milk. And like I said, I'm just going to put like a little bit because, you know, Trying to eat healthy, so loading it up with sugar is basically defeating the whole point. So, but I just want to add a little bit of sugar just to kind of like make that sweet in the sweet potato pop a little bit and add some milk to make it a little bit more creamy. So, this is how it looks with the sugar added in. 
and I just put like like that much sugar like two times so I did like that and then um, and then another and that was all I put in there so now I'm gonna um add the milk hi AJ and that's probably all I'm gonna add And so this is the consistency that it is. So I'm going to leave it at this and this will be my mashed sweet potatoes. And let's give it a taste. Oh, yeah. When I was gutting the sweet potatoes, <laughs> scraping the insides out, my advice would be to do that when it cools off. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, so I'm going to do a quick little taste. And then I'll get a serving spoon and go ahead and fix our plates in a little bit. That's good. Yay! So, got my dinner all warm and ready to go. So now, clean up. And all I gotta do is just scrape this in the trash. Easy. All right, so I fixed AJ um, a plate. I gave him some sweet potatoes and um, spinach, so he's eating now. And this is my plate. I added some oranges to mine so my plate wouldn't look, you know, completely like just empty. Because it doesn't take much for me to get full and be satisfied anyway. So I don't need like this big, huge plate full of food. Like I just, I just need enough. Um. But y'all, like this dinner, like I can grow this in my garden, which I'm going to be starting my garden. Um, if you go to supermomsjourney.com, you'll see that um, one of my latest posts is how to start a, gar a garden. And um, this is what I'm going to be growing, spinach and sweet potatoes. So all I would have to do is just go out and pick in the garden and boom, I have dinner. And grocery bill, zero. Well, the grocery bill won't be zero, but this meal will be zero. <laughs>